Well, hey, good morning, Kern County, and happy Friday. We are heading into a hot weekend, but at least it's a dry heat. Next week, getting hotter and more humid. That's going to be a bit uncomfortable. So let's take a look outside right now where you see that monsoon is still stuck there in the desert southwest. So, yeah, some rain is wrapping around. You're going to see that here on our storm shield Doppler just coming over the state line today. I think we are dry and sunny, and that's because of this feed of dry air that we have coming in from the southwest right on through the weekend. It leaves us a bit breezy in the mountains, but it's just slightly moving air. It's not going to give us any relief from that heat, especially here in the valley. See how clear and calm those skies are? So with the wind speed future cast you can see it picks up through the mountain passes down into the desert a little bit there on the west side of the valley as well here in Bakersfield single digits up in the mountains about 10 to 20 mile an hour winds 25 mile an hour gusts this afternoon that's pretty much what we've seen the last couple afternoons again not a strong wind so it's just leaving a little bit of a breeze and we will still collect more and more pollution here on the valley floor we are now way up on our air quality ranking unhealthy for sensitive groups actually only about 10 points away from being unhealthy for everybody and I expect that ranking by tomorrow if not Sunday so take it easy on your lungs it's gonna be really hot so especially in the afternoon hours you're gonna to want to stay inside look at these widespread triple digits 104 in Bakersfield 103 in Wasco today 102 for McFarland 99 in Kernville and Isabella 89 in Tatchby, and there's that 85 for Fraser Park. Into our deserts, it's even hotter. 110 in Cal City today, and if you can believe it, we're going to keep those temperatures right on through the weekend. You see our future cast leaves us very sunny and dry today. That's the story through Sunday. Then on Monday, you see some cloud cover coming in. Tuesday and Wednesday, even hotter, feeling more humid. That lasts into Thursday, and that's thanks to a little bit of this hurricane moisture trying to move up with Hurricane Hillary, which has now been downgraded this morning to a tropical storm. So for our friends in the Kern River Valley, you're seeing temperatures jump up to the 100s there tomorrow, and then upper 90s and humid Monday and Tuesday before the 100s are back. Tatchby, upper 80s today and tomorrow, 90s by Sunday in Fraser Park. That means you hold on to the 80s for the next several afternoons. So find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Let me know what you think about this forecast and how you're going to stay cool this weekend.